The second supplementary question will be asked by the Honorable W.M. Thring. Thring. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Deputy President, the African Christian Democratic Party has long argued that one of the key determinants of good governance is a professional public sector that is not accountable to a political party, but to government and the public that they are called to serve. And so the ACDP supports the draft national implementation framework towards the professionalization of the public service, which aims to build, <clears throat> amongst other things, a better state, uh, which serves our people and one that is insulated from undue political interference where appointments are made on merit. As we know, many a good draft has been blown away by the drafts of ill-conceived popular political opinion. Now, can the Deputy President, the Honorable Deputy President, um, reveal the timelines? Your time is up. Reveal the timelines and the spheres of government targeted for the implementation of a pro professional public service. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable Member. The Honorable the Deputy President. Thank you, thank you, Honorable Speaker. And thank for the support of the framework. Now, because we've adopted the framework already as cabinet, that means it's now going to be implemented. But the first thing that we've done is to extend the term of office of all uh, DGs. Firstly, the term of office was five years and we've extended it to 10 years. The simple reason is that when a teacher is appointed, first year is acquainting himself or herself with the environment. The second year is starting to implement, but by the third year, he or she must be looking for uh, spaces somewhere else because he or she is aware that is on the exit. Now, we want to create stability within the public sector. By appointing teachers for a longer period, that we think will bring stability. That does not mean the performance management will be set aside. From time to time, we are going to conduct performance management uh, where these teachers are going to be assessed for their performance. And if they are not doing very well, it is up to the executive authority at that level to determine their fate. Thank you very much.